The Western Hula Gibbon is the only ape species in Bangladesh, and they have been by far the most devastated of all the gibbon species as a direct result of the destruction of their forest habitat. Primate census studies that were conducted in the 1970s indicated that this monogamous and territorial gibbon species numbered in the several thousands throughout all of Bangladesh in their forested regions. However, the vast majority of the country's forests have been recently cut down at an alarming rate for the timber, to make room for farmlands, rice paddies, oil palm plantations, tea and rubber plantations, and for human housing. Today, the wild hula gibbons of Bangladesh are not a stable, viable population, and it has been projected that there are now less than 300 still alive, with that number dwindling fast as their forested habitat is relentlessly being destroyed. This amazing ape species is now on the brink of extinction in Bangladesh, and the entire remaining population may well collapse completely in just a few short years if nothing is done to save them now. Hello, I'm Dr. Elliot Hamoff. When I first started my academic career studying gibbons and their behavior back in the kinder, gentler days of 1975, I used a brand new prototype of an invention called a portable field video camera that in fact required two people to operate and use manually threaded reel-to-reel -reel videotape spools. Who would have thought at that time that I would now be called a pioneer in Gibbon studies by doing that? Perhaps the use of video in this program of the Hula Gibbons of Bangladesh could potentially be used to generate some public awareness as to their plight and possibly to help build a consensus with politicians and government officials to conserve and protect the remaining few gibbons that are still alive there. The hope is to help bring them back from the brink of extinction, if, of course, it's not too late.